Hi, welcome to this hands-on session on Databricks. I am Aliza Tanvir and in this lesson you will learn how to visualize the data or the result in the form of different graphs and charts and also how to create a dashboard. By the end of the lesson you will have learned how to create bar charts and also other type of charts, what plot options are present in Databricks and in the end you will have created a complete dashboard with multiple different charts. Let's start by creating a notebook, give a suitable name to your notebook and then for the default language select SQL. We'll start by just looking at the data we have and for that I'm going to select all the record from the table which is the cleaned wine data and it is going to display me all the rows present within that particular table. Then I'll move one step further and I'm going to select quality and the count for each quality type and I'm going to order and group by the result on the basis of quality. And the result set will show me quality and the number of records for each quality. Upon executing you will see quality and count. Now we will move towards visualization of data. For visualizing the data click the plus sign and then select visualization and then from the visualization type select bar chart. Here you can see that on the x axis we have the quality and the y axis we have the count. So the data is visualized by a bar graph. Now we will write another query in which I am going to select the alcohol and round off the value and I am going to visualize it also using a different type of graph. In order to visualize the result set of this query I am going to select a different type of graph which is going to be a pie chart. Now the pie chart is asking me to enter another column for the y axis so I am going to click add column and then it is going to create the pie chart. Databricks has created a very beautiful pie chart for it and the data is easily readable using this pie chart. Let's write another query. In this query I am going to select the quality and the pH for each quality and I am going to group the data on the basis of quality to make it presentable. Upon executing the query you will see the tabular result for the query but we are also going to visualize it but this time we are going to select a new type which is the box plot. The box plot will show you the range of the pH for each quality and you can also change the color of the bar graph by using colors and simply selecting an appropriate color of your choice for it. After visualizing the data, now we'll create a dashboard by clicking file and selecting new dashboard from it. Give a suitable name to your dashboard and start removing the tabular results because we only need different type of graphs for our dashboard and not the tabular results. Once we are only left with different type of charts, arrange the charts according to your will and the way you like them and once the charts are fixed, we are going to present it. In order to present the dashboard, click the present dashboard button on the right hand side and then upon clicking the press button, your dashboard will be presented in a new screen where you can view different type of chart and hover over the values to see different values of the graphs. And in this way you can use different type of graphs and charts to visualize the results of your queries and present it in the form of dashboard. And this is all about the visualization of data using different type of bar graphs on the Databricks as well as the Databricks lessons. Thank you.